Okay, okay, you AMD nerds, I got something for you. Oh, you see? Oh, so you want more performance, huh? All right, we got some. We got some. We got. I got something for that. Listen to this. Oh, by the way, hello viewers. Another beautiful day. Hope your five senses work. Health and strength good. Or excellent. Yeah. All right, listen to this. Gigabyte X3D Turbo Mode promise up to 35% higher gaming performance on Ryzen 9000 X3D. Ryzen 9000 could see up to 20% improvement. Okay, you want performance, you got it. Says Gigabyte claimed that X3D Turbo Mode enables Ryzen 9000 CPUs to achieve similar gaming performance level as their Ryzen uh, X3D counterpart. Mm. Says in a surprise turn of event, in a surprise turn of events, Gigabyte has announced its new X3D Turbo Mode feature for its motherboard. The feature is designed to boost the performance of AMD Ryzen 7000X 7000 3D, Ryzen 9000 X3D, and Ryzen 9000 processors by up to 20 to 35 percent. The company said that the X said that the X3D Turbo Mode is a set of unique optimization parameters that can tangibly improve the performance of AMD CPUs. Gigabyte says the X3D Turbo Mode features will be available on its AMD X870E, X870, and 6000 series motherboards with the F4E BIOS version and AMD AGESA 1.2.0.2A. The compatibility report boosts gaming performance by up to 35%. For incoming Ryzen 9000 X3D CPUs, up to 20% of Ryzen 9000 processors, and by an unknown margin of Ryzen 7000 X3D products, without uh, clearing spe uh, clearly specifying the baseline of co for comparison, yet it acknowledges that performance improvements depend on processor models and DRM conditions. Gigabyte goes so far as to say that the X3D Turbo enables Ryzen 9000 CPUs to achieve similar gaming performance level as their Ryzen X3D counterparts, which is a bold claim considering that 3D V cache provides substantial single thread performance improvement uh, that's tangible boost uh, games uh, performance. And anything else? On this says here uh, gigabyte does not disclose how exactly its x3d turbo mode works nor specifically whether it improves overclocking or boosting power limits it does say that the uh, let's see if I can get this here it does it does say that the unique optimization parameter enables smoother gameplay higher frames rate reduced latency which implies memory sub subsystem turning however it's hard to believe that tweaking memory per parameters alone can deliver performance increase between 20 and 35 percent. Well, the more memory you have, the better your um, the better your game runs. You know, <laughs> you know, considering that Gigabyte perf promises performance boost for AMD Ryzen um, 7000 X 3D, Ryzen 9000 X 3D, and Ryzen 9000 uh, CPUs, the company is doing something. Not specific to AMD Zen 5 based Ryzen series, but that works for both Ryzen 7000 and 9000 series, but not for the Ryzen 8000 series for some reason. And then it says uh, it should also be taken into account that Gigabyte X3D Turbo Mode requires AMD HSA 1.2.0.2A. It is possible that the CPU designer itself discovered a way to improve the performance of its products. And Gigabyte uses the new set of uh, parameters for its X3D Turbo mode. Anyhow, let us wait and see what this mode is all about. And, uh oh, that is the end of the article. Tom's Hardware. Anton wrote this. But anyway, um, yeah, back to that, back to that, uh, where it says, uh, where where he says, where where he says, uh, it says hard to believe that tweaking memory parameters al al alone can deliver performance increase between and third, twenty and thirty five percent. Well, 
Well, um, you can have a high-end CPU, a high-end graphics card, and a good motherboard. That sounds good. But that memory? Oh yeah. That's the <laughs> that's that's the get that's like the gasoline to your to your to your computer to make uh to make things run better. So to make to make your uh all your parts in the computer runs better. So never underestimate memory in your computers. <laughs> so yeah. It, it it does play a huge factor in your um in your performance in gaming, you know. Yeah. The more memory you have the better. You know, so if you can get twenty to thirty five percent more juice out of it, that's pretty good. And um looks like that's that's what they just did. So uh Gigabyte was up to looked like Gigabyte was uh experimenting in the lab, so to speak. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh yeah, um uh <laughs> Uh, that's the that's that's it in a nutshell though. But the more memory you have in your in your in your in your desktop, the better. The you, you um it, it makes your it makes your system performs good, you know? and um you know makes the operating system runs better, runs runs smoother. Things are clicking on all cylinders, man. You ever notice like <laughs> when if you have like a high end CPU, a high end graphics card on a board, and then you have less RAM, you're not getting that performance that you need. That should tell you something. So yeah, but uh, one of these engineers or pro one of these engineers over at uh, Gigabyte figured it out. So yeah, welcome to the 21st century. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this video for y'all to enjoy. Though nice talking to you people again. Chris, those Star Wars Star Trek thank board dark side. Go, peace.